As the central part of the circulatory system, the heart has dual responsibilities of pumping oxygenated blood to the body and pumping oxygen-poor blood to the lungs. Deoxygenated blood comes into the right atrium from the body, moves into the right ventricle, and is pushed into the pulmonary arteries in the lungs. After picking up oxygen, the blood travels back to the heart through the pulmonary veins into the left atrium, to the left ventricle, and out to the body's tissues through the aorta. Extracorporeal membrane oxygenation, ECMO, is an advanced type of life support that can provide circulation and oxygenation when the heart and lungs aren't functioning properly. The most common cannulation technique for VA ECMO is via the femoral artery and vein. ECMO drains blood from the human body through femoral vein catheter. Then blood is pumped to an oxygenator where blood oxygenation occurs. The arterial return is directed into descending aorta in a retrograde fashion via the femoral arterial catheter, which forms a mixing cloud between blood returned by the ECMO circuit and blood ejected by the left ventricle. The location of the mixing point depends upon the amount of ECMO support provided and the degree of left ventricular ejection. Differential hypoxemia between the upper and lower parts of the body can be a complication. If left unrecognized upper body hypoxemia can occur, what we call Harlequin syndrome, 